Hey everybody, welcome back to my Project 13. Thanks for coming on by and checking out this product review video. Appreciate your time and your support. Huge shout out, Poetic. They sent me the Poetic Guardian with magnet for MagSafe for my Google Pixel 8 Pro. I'm gonna get into the box right away because there's a lot to look at as far as the two different frames that we get for the front of the Google Pixel 8 Pro. I will be leaving all the information as far as purchasing the Guardian case from Poetic down below in the description area, along with a link for the screen protector, the temper glass screen protector I have on the super actual display of my Google Pixel 8 Pro. Now, the one thing that Poetic gives you is options. The option to use the frame without a built-in screen protector, and that's this guy. Hard plastic polycarbonate material. And they give you a frame with a built-in screen protector. And I'm actually going to use that today in this video. I'm gonna put it over the top of my tempered glass screen protector. We may have to reset the um, fingerprint, but Maybe we won't. Okay, if I can just figure out how to... Oh, there we go. All right. And I'll explain everything that you need to know on how to utilize that fingerprint ID that's on the built-in screen protector. And there you have the magnet for MagSafe. I'll be testing the strength out uh, for that area later. At the bottom right hand corner, there's a little gap there. You can place your thumbnail right in there and pull the frame with the built-in screen protector away from the back part. Now you do get instructions for everything that I'm going to be showing and talking about in this video. So please read everything, please. Put that to the side. We do have screen protector accessories to clean off the front of my display. Okay, you got some dust absorbers here, got your alcohol prep wipe and your little micro cloth. On the inside, there's a piece of film here and underneath that there's adhesive. So once I clean off my Google Pixel 8 Pro, I want to peel that little piece of film off and put the frame with the built-in screen protector right over the top and then I want to rub down on that area making sure that it, the adhesive is adhering it's sticking to the display of my 8 Pro okay so let's go ahead and do that really quick so we're going to do this one first Then, bam. Okay, over the top. And then we wanna rub down on that area to make sure the, I pulled back so I could get into the display of my Google Pixel 8 Pro utilizing the pattern, but the face unlock worked so freaking fast. It was like, okay. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, you just really want to wipe down in that area. And you can barely see it. You can see it right there. Okay, you can see it right there where the fingerprint ID is. Okay, so what I want to know is... Well, first of all, let's put the back part of the case on. So you take the back part, kind of an angle like this. Okay, and then you just kind of... Not just kind of, you just do. You work your way up bringing the back part of the case with the hard plastic polycarbonate see-through back. Got a lot of TPU material and hard plastic polycarbonate material all working together. There is some flex to the back part of the case. Just wanna make sure there's no gaps. Everything is tight and snug. You can see all of that lip and depth protecting that camera bar and those cameras so you can take great quality pictures and shoot great quality video. Totally digging the fact that you can see that bay blue back there 
Got the Poetic brand name at the bottom there. A lot of corner protection cut out for the top mic there. And you got to cut out for the speaker grill, cut out for the mic at the bottom there. And a flat protecting the USB Type-C charging port from Dirt, Dust, and Lint. And also want to point out the depth of these two cutouts for the speaker and mic area. That's to keep dirt, dust, and lint out of there as well, especially for those of you that work in a rugged environment. And with all that crap in the corner of your pockets, purses, bags, that's where the depth of those cutouts really, really come in handy. Okay. A lot of grip along the sides, volume rocker down, up, and there's your power button all covered up. Everything is going to work great. Okay. And uh, volume rocker, that's going to work great. I know I'm getting to that fingerprint ID. I just wanted to get to all of this really quick. But most of you know, if you've used Poetic products, you cannot go wrong. Everything is going to work. All the cutouts will be precise. You're going to have plenty of lip protecting, not just the display. I mean, look at all of that lip. Plus the plastic built-in screen protector. Plus my tempered glass screen protector. So you're good to go on a flat surface. Surface is a little bit rough. Anything rougher than that, use your discretion. But... I'm, I'm totally protected here. On the back, flat surface, surface is a little bit rough, I'm good to go. Anything rougher than that, I would probably sport a camera glass protector. But yeah, use your discretion. Okay, so let's get to the fingerprint ID that is adhered to the fingerprint reader on my Google Pixel 8 Pro. So ready? Bam, did you see that? Do I need to do it again? All right, I'll do it again. Boom. Temper glass screen protector and the plastic built-in screen protector, and there are no issues. Now, as far as the touch response on the display, no issues, okay? No issues. No issues. All right. Yeah, that is strong, folks. That is strong. I'm digging it. Okay, so let's remove it, put it back on, and bam, just like that. A regular wireless charger. Boom. There we go. I didn't mention I didn't mention that recessed area up top for the combo earpiece and speaker. All cutouts will be precise. The functionality of the volume rocker, power button, thumbs up, lots of lip protecting that super actual display, fingerprint reader working great with the fingerprint ID with that built-in screen protector that is plastic on the back. Got that see-through back. Looks great. Got that magnet for MagSafe. A lot of lip around the case too. Just rising above that back. So on a flat surface or a surface is a little bit rough. It won't easily scratch up that back. A lot of lip and depth surrounding those cameras. I would still definitely sport a camera glass protector. Yeah, look at all that corner protection to absorb shock. Got a lot going on here. Plenty of grip. Lots of protection. Poetic. Always getting it right. You cannot go wrong with Poetic. All the information for the Guardian from Poetic down below in the description area and a link as well for the Timber Glass Grip Protector. With that, peace. God bless. I'm out.